Hey guys, and welcome back to another video on the channel, and today we are bringing back the Forza Horizon 3 for episode number 3, I believe, of the series, and I just wanted to fill you in with some some of the things that I did offline, or off camera, sorry, uh, before we get into what you see on the screen here. So first, I did come second in the Apostles Beach Cross Country Race, and we roughly gained about 3,000 uh, fans. Yes, I came second in that, but it was actually pretty, it was a pretty rough race, I, I think it was because of the first race I did today. It was pretty rough, but whatever, we'll move on for that. And then we also came first in the beep, it was called the Deep Water Cross Country Circuit. And we roughly gained about 2,500 fans there. So that got us close to roughly about 24,000 out of the 26,900 fans that we needed to upgrade to get this, what you're seeing on the screen here. But I also did a speed thing where they set up speed traps. And all you got to do is literally go the fastest you can through those speed traps and you gain fans off of it. So that's where we gained roughly about the other 2,500 fans that we needed to get the festival upgrade. But on here, oh, and we also leveled up and got 50,000 credits. Because you know every time how we level up, you get the little uh, spinny boy thing that pops up and get it. So we got 50,000 credits off of that. But anyways, let's get into the important part. And that is right here. These are the two areas where we get to pick um, where our new festival site is going to be. So we get the Outback Festival, which when our assistant was talking to us she said it's very open it's very like it's basically in the desert type thing um and there's that and then there's the surfers one which is just pretty tight quick corners quick turns everything like that and personally i think i really want to go into surfers paradise because that looks like you're literally in downtown australia um and it looks like a sick sick place to be so we're going to be cho choosing surfers paradise festival so coming soon tickets on sale now we are going to start this site up and see how we do. Let's get in. Horizon Surfers Paradise. I can set everything up and get the party started. Feel free to stick around here and arrive fashionably late. Okay, so here's actually a cool little thing. It says Community Breakdown. It says 35% of players also chose Surfers Paradise as their second festival. So it seems like a lot of them chose the Outback one, which is shocking. I thought a lot of people would have been... I wanted to be in the city, but we are going to continue and see where we pop up. So we're literally across the shore there, right at the Horizon Fi Ugh, Festival site in downtown. What looks to be a city in Australia there. I'm not sure exactly where, but we are going to set the route and we are going to make our way there. And I'll see you guys in literally just a second once we're at it, entering the city. Look at this, guys. We are literally driving straight through the desert here. Oops, excuse me. Pardon me. And our destination, as you can see in the top right there, is roughly about 9.5 kilometers away. But we had to drive through, well, maybe it wasn't the dead, dead, dead or, <laughs> the desert, maybe it was just kind of the grasslands. But this is sick, man. Again, I'm, I'm going to keep saying it probably every episode. The graphics on this game are outstanding. Like, great job to the developers of this game. Just makes me, like, this really just makes me want to go to Australia so bad. I've always wanted to go to Australia, but obviously I just don't have the money to. Maybe sometime in the future, but Australia looks amazing. It's so diverse. It has the city life for people. Shut up, freaking GPS. It has the city life for people, but for me, it's just like everything else. It's the wildlife, just how everything... Oh, shit. Well, that was a sudden fucking turn. Thanks for letting me know. Actually, she probably did let me know. I was just talking over her. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. Australia would be amazing to go to one day. Um, but, yeah, here's hoping I do. And I do see the, see the skitty, skitty. I cannot speak today. I do see the city in the horizon there. Oh, my God. What? We're just straight. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, my God. That was a rock. I thought that was a leaf or a plant or a fucking shrub. That's what I'm trying to say. But we are literally, we are like in the abandoned. Oh, what's up, buddy? We are literally in like an abandoned like shipwreck what looks to be like that looks amazing. Oh this game just put in everything. So we're about two kilometers away and it looks like we're literally just entering the heart of the city and oh this is amazing. Like I'm fucking goo goo guying over all this shit but like you don't understand how amazing I find this. Okay, sorry, sorry, shit. I might want to focus on driving other than looking at scenery. In 400 meters, bear right. 400 meters, bear right. Ow, smooth. Woohoo, beaches. Gonna get some hot ladies there. Yes, we are. Keep All right. right. Yes, yes, keep right, keep right. I understand. Meters. Jesus. Turn left. Stop driving on your side of the road. I'm trying to drive on your side of the road. There we go. 300. Turn 200. 
100. And we are there. And we are about to build the Surfers Paradise Festival site. We got another achievement, yes! Horizon Surfers Paradise. People can walk straight from the beach to the stage to the starting barrier. It's a masterpiece, even if I do say so myself. I've been checking out the festival, making new friends. Most of them are cars, but you know. Speaking of, you're here to collect another one, yeah? All right, you you heard Warren there. We're here to collect another car. This is sick. We get another car, and these look like it's going to be the muscle category for these cars. So we have the Chevrolet Camaro Z28, the Dodge Charger R T 1969, the Dodge Dart Hemi Superstock, the Ford Falcon. Ooh, the Falcons are always nice. X Y Geitho Phase Three, and the Holden Torana. A9X. I'm probably butchering some of these names, but these look so cool. Look how much. Okay, so the Camaro is usually on for 53000 We get it for free. And look at this. $125,000. Like $125,000 car. $130,000 car, and we get it for free. That is sick. But I don't know. Um, It's the Charger or Camaro. The Camaro does look super nice, and I do actually like that paint on it. But I think I'm going to go... I'm going to go with the Camaro. I'm going to go with the 1970 Chevrolet Camaro Z28. Let's get in. Thank you, Chevrolet, for the free car. All right, guys, and as you know, we do get to pick a paint for the car. So we have the Badass Ghost Flame, which actually looks very sick. We have a lot of other cars here, and oh... Ooh, that red and black, Porthole Z28, like that red and black with that engine on the top showing. Ooh, that looks beautiful. I don't know, that might be the one. Let's see, where else are we here? This would actually be a really cool game to probably live stream, just because then you guys are there to give me suggestions on the type of paint I want. And um, But I think the paint that really catches my eye is that red and black just back here. This one actually looks so sick. So Chain S63, thank you for the designs, and I'm going to choose yours, and thank you so, so much for it. Okay, so as you can see here, these are the stations that we have signed already. So as I said in the last episode, we signed Horizon Boss Arena and the Horizon Block Party. So we have Pulse here, which is Amy Simpson and Horizon Pulse return with their signature laid-back electronic sound. We've actually unlocked a couple. And I'm trying to hear them here. I mean, it doesn't really matter to us because we don't listen to the radio. Jeez, that is classic. Music. We're going to go with the hospital. The hospital re records radio. So yes, we are going to sign hospital you. And do we actually radio. have... Oh. All drum and bass, all the time. You got it. Leave it to me. And we do get to sign another one. So I think I'm going to do Vagrant. I, I, I was listening to Vagrant right there and it actually sounds pretty cool. Horizon Online is now available. Alright, that is sick actually. So we have online, but we are going to stay offline just for now. This is Horizon Online. In Horizon Online, coming first isn't everything. Make it clean, make it stylish, make it look good, and you could earn as much XP as the bloke out in front. You've got three ways to play. In Online Adventure, we'll set you up with a bunch of great events all over the country. You and your friends can get straight into the action. All you have to do is drive. Online Free Roam lets you choose your own adventure. We'll turn you and your mates loose on this wide open land. Take some cars out of the garage, run events, tick off the bucket list, or just roam till the sun goes down. And now, for the first time, you can play a Horizon campaign in co-op. Work with your mates to make Horizon Australia the biggest horizon there's ever been. And everything you do in co-op still counts in your solo campaign. So don't be shy.
do have a skill shop here and we do have one skill point and the only one that's really open is drone mode so it says anything you discover with drone mode is added to your map points of interest locations and even barn finds so that's pretty cool we are going to buy that use our one skill point on the drone and we have our first skill are there are other types of cars that we can get using our credit so as you can see some of these cars look like oh the gta spano that looks so nice that'd be dope to get for eight hundred thousand. right now i believe i only have actually I have no idea oh 135,000 credits so we cannot we can't get to these type of cars right now but oh i pray to god in the future we really can because i'd be sick to get these cars but this was literally just in the um rewards thing so that's pretty cool and we get the smoking tire car oh some of these cars they must i mean they are the same but they must just uh have smoky things but that is so sick all right guys so we are going to set up an event here and it's the three bridge circuit we're just going to do an exhibition maybe i'll do some rivals with some guys um who check out the videos or just some of my buddies who have the game so i'm going to click on the exhibition we're going to get right in you your friends are enjoying the races we've set up but this is your festival we take orders from you. So, let's talk about Horizon Blueprint. Blueprint, you decide where and how and how fast. Set race conditions, number of laps, car themes and categories, and then run your events your way with your friends. The race, and we are doing this circuit race here, it's two laps, and I remember the person, or the girl, our assistant there, saying when we did choose the city, that is a very, it's, it's not all about speed, it's about just being able to like do those sharp turns, those nice quick turns, so we don't have to use all speed here. And I am going to show you guys this full race, and oh my god, I am so bad at driving. I do want to show you guys this full race because since there, this is probably going to be the only race in this episode because we've had a lot to do with expanding the festival. Um, I just want to show you this whole race so at least you guys get some gameplay out of me, like actually racing. It's not just a bunch of cutscenes and everything. But right now we are fourth, and this is still the first lap, and see see what I mean? I'm banging into people, which isn't the cleanest of driving. I'm banging into walls, garbage cans. I'm a shit driver, basically. But it's it, like the girl said, and I was watching actually that online thing, which you guys will see as well. Um, they said it's not all about coming first. It's about clean, getting those clean races, looking good while racing, and getting those points up, because those are what the fans want to see. They don't care if they you come first. You can get the same amount of points coming like freaking eighth out of 12 people as long as you still get, as long as you make the race look good is what I'm saying. So that is, yeah, that's it. But we are second right now and we're only fur or behind red brick plans, I think it was called. And I really wish we could have, okay, this is the straightaway where we're able to catch up. And I think we just finished our first lap there. That's not bad. First lap in a minute 28, minute 28, made minute minute 29 we did our first lap so i was very confused on the times there buddy don't just break in front of me big boy these are expensive cars i mean i got mine for free i don't know how much you paid for yours i got mine for free because i'm a g but oh we pulled out i didn't even notice that i was talking too much okay let's go boys i am so pumped i want to get this race over and just like keep expanding this is so i'm so happy we got into the city like, I'm happy I chose the city over the Outback. I feel like the city gives a lot more. And, I don't know, the city looked really cool when I was looking at pictures and that of this game. Oh, too fast around this corner once again. God damn, I'm so bad at that one corner. Um, but the city looks so cool in the pictures and clip shots and everything that I saw this game. So I really wanted to get into this city. I'm really happy I chose the city because it, it just looks amazing. And like I said, I really do want to go to Australia, but... It just it's expensive to get there from Canada like the flights are expensive and then on top of freaking hotels and everything it's brutal but oh I would love to one day one day I will and I'm hoping nothing kills me because apparently everything in Australia can kill you and I think there's a driver literally right on my tail I didn't notice this I was too busy talking but I'm pretty sure there's a driver like right on my tail right now oh wait how do I look back oh no how do I look back I forget there it is oh, okay we beat him we're fine. First place. Boom. So guys, we gained roughly about 7,000, not roughly, we did gain 7,055 credits. So our balance is 142,947 credits. 
So we finished first, that gave us 4,000 lineup bonus skills, clean racing, total of 6,775 XP. We're so close to upgrading and getting another spin on the XP wheel, I think it's called, or whatever the wheel was called where we get the uh, credits. I don't know. I've got something big planned, boss. All I need is a few more fans through the gate. Just get out there and do something impressive, will you? You know I do impressive. Everything I do is impressive. So don't don't say I don't do anything impressive. I do impressive. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. But anyways, guys, as you can see, we roughly gained, I think that's around 4,900, maybe 5,000 fans on that race. So that's actually pretty sick. But our festival expansion goals is 42,800. I need another 10,000 fans. So we are going to be doing a few more races in upcoming episodes to help gain those fans and possibly other things. But uh, yeah, that's probably going to be the end of this episode here. I think it is going to be the end, actually. It is going to be the end of this episode, as I said. And actually, I was just kind of scrolling around my car here, and this looks so nice. I love the paint on this car. It looks amazing, and I'm really happy I chose this type of design. Sorry, not paint this design on the car. But uh, that is going to be the end. I know it's only around one race, and I'm sorry about that. But I really just wanted you to see the cutscenes and where we are choosing our, no our new expansion and what city or the outback I was chosen. And I am so happy with this city. Like, look at this here. This is amazing. I'm so happy I chose this city here and it looks so nice. Um, but yeah, that is going to be the end of this episode. I'm going to keep reversing on the wrong side of the road. I pray to God nobody comes down this way because I'm going to get smacked. But I hope you guys did enjoy, and if you did, remember to leave a like. If you have any suggestions or you guys have any like things about being going online, I will go online, but I'm not sure when yet. Um, but going online, joining people's crew. I know the one guy that I mentioned in the last episode, he mentioned his crew, so I think I might join him. But uh, anyways, thanks you, thanks you, thanks you. Yes, English. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Like, comment, subscribe. All that